que George. When are they leaving for Paris? Not for another three days. What about her place? She lives with her parents. Then maybe this will become like a cool thing, living with your parents. <laughs> yeah, then maybe baldness will catch on. <laughs> George is like, excuse me. By the way, my parents really want to have your parents over for dinner before they leave town. Yeah, like this. Oh, I know him. I was wondering if either one of you guys would be interested in doing some work for the Big Brother program. <laughs> Don't have George do it. <laughs> well, uh... Wouldn't you like to be a big brother? Please. Well... Not him saying please. I'll get in touch with you. That dude, though, he was on that show. I forget. The Parkers? Was it called The Parkers? Professor Ogilvy? Wouldn't you like to pass the ketchup to someone like me? <laughs> Shut up, Jerry. Uh. Your parents are going to Paris, right? Yeah. So I tell Alec that I have to go to Paris. Then all I have to do is buy some postcards and have your parents mail them from Paris. George, always up to something. Always lying. <laughs> Later. Why are you doing this? He wants this guy to think he's in Paris. Why? Because George is a deeply disturbed individual. <laughs> yes, he is. Oh, Kramer. I'm still not over the last episode. His ass was so tan. So burnt. My father's got a ton of old clothes just sitting up on the attic. You, you think they're worth something? Well, yeah, if they're vintage. Ugh. <laughs> Too much lotion. Uh, my parents really want to have you guys over for dinner before you leave town. We have plans. What plans? We have plans. They don't want to go meet George's parents. Maybe. Mm-hmm. Hey, give them our best, though. Yeah. Uh, George is like, mm-hmm. Something's wrong. I smell a rat. <laughs> Jerry, we don't care much for the Costanzas. We can't stand them. Really? The dad is brutally honest. The mom is cute about it. Hey. Look at him. He was on Beverly Hills Cop. How long are you folks in town? Bruh. Oh my goodness. Three more days. Personal space. <laughs> I love France. I was just there last year. In fact, you know, I have a friend who works at the Metropolitan Museum of Art. <laughs> what is wrong with him? How about you, Jerry? <laughs> you could kiss the man. We're off. Okay. Bye. So the parents don't mind a close talker, but they don't like yelling. <laughs> Meanwhile, they had plans. How could they have plans? That's what I want to know. What difference does it make? They wouldn't buy to it. Look at the mother. She's offended. What am I supposed to do with all this paella? Maybe they don't like us. Why wouldn't they like us? They don't like you. <laughs> Much later. Oh, you must be Kramer. I've heard about you. <laughs> I've heard about you. <laughs> See you later. Yeah. Yeah, Kramer. What's Kramer wearing? <laughs> Look at that, Helen. Huh? Do you see what he's wearing? That's the executive. Now, what is the executive? The executive. Oh, my father invented it. I sure did. These haven't been made in 20 years. Why would they? Nobody bought them then. <laughs> <laughs> no support. That's my wife, everybody. <laughs> You know, you give me 25%, I'll, I'll take care of everything. Hold up. Oh, no, not them going in business. <laughs> Smith and Wesson. Smith and Wesson. Much, much later. I'll be leaving for Paris in two days. So... Lion ass. No, I feel terrible about Joey. This is going to blow up in his face. Wait for it. I, I don't even know how long I'm going to be away from. We've been trying to reunite Joey with his father, who lives in Paris. <laughs> but he's... Told you. Backfire. <laughs> and you'll send me a postcard much 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 later you didn't feel uncomfortable spending the whole day at the museum with two complete strangers it was fun you had fun with mr and mrs seinfeld she's like we are very different people <laughs> they bought me a coke <laughs> well 
Well, that explains it. The Coke. Uh. You think they're coming tonight? I don't know. They said maybe. Look at George. He got bedhead. We should take a trip. Maybe a cruise. A long cruise. <laughs> Just the two of them. <laughs> George is like, go. Please. Just then. I just couldn't accept the fact that dad was really gone. <gasps> Look at George getting rid of his parents' clothes. Ooh, don't let the mommy find out. George! I'll give you uh, $200 for the three boxes. Could you make it 225 That was his high game in bowling. Yeah, I'm in a good mood here. <laughs> hey, George. Morty Seinfeld and I are going into business together, selling raincoats. Hey, that's swell. Yeah, we worked it out all over dinner last night. Was this something you had planned for a while? No. He knows. Well, you, they had plans. They had plans. <laughs> Come on now, George. You know your parents are crazy. Two for twenty-five dollars. Oh, I'll take these. <gasps> no, Kramer. <laughs> oh. That's the executive. He's buying their clothes. What are you talking about? Mom and Pop Seinfeld. Look, I don't know. All right, I happen to know what they did last night. They had dinner with Kramer. <laughs> oh. Is there something wrong with my parents? Yes. Because my parents happen to be two pretty wonderful people. These are the same people you currently live with? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry's like, come on now. Don't be in denial. Do you think your parents would have any objections to taking a little kid to Paris with them? Bruh. I had a feeling he was gonna try this. Meanwhile. Uh, hi, Eric. Hey, Joey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> oh, God, that would bother me. I would have a conversation with him. <laughs> oh, no. Why are they there? <laughs> I was able to finagle two more tickets to My Fair Lady, and I thought, why not ask Morty and Helen? This is so weird. Why does he want to hang with them so much? I could have danced tonight. Look at Elaine. She's in hell. <laughs> They're busy, huh? <laughs> A lot of boring math later. We better not. Look, they're gonna be here any second. When are they leaving? Terry's like, no, my parents will catch me in the act. Boy, that was some show. What show? My fair lady. Aaron surprised us, and Elaine came. Yeah. Oh, Elaine, really? <laughs> He's like, I can't wait to talk to her later. One extremely annoying shift later. They were drinking champagne in a buggy. First Kramer, then Elaine. Yeah. Damn, George. No, you're not gossiping. You know your parents are crazy. I want to know what we did. <laughs> what are they too good for us? They too good for us. Buy a song. The lying. <laughs> when you do that every day. We're going on a beautiful vacation. <laughs> But I can't find any of my vacation clothes. They were in the attic. The attic? Shit. Shit! Mouse! I saw mouse! It's the remote! That scream! What? Why is he burning it? 